Okay, so I'm doing this differently. Um, originally I was filming something and I was reading and I'm like, you know what, people don't want to watch this. I've been looking at the click rate thing and people just like go straight for the gotcha spins. So that's what we're doing. Um, and then we'll talk about the charm point update and do some experimenting with uh, this recent gotcha for, um, I mean the night school, night breeze anthem. I want to ch test something, but we're not doing that now. Now I have spun this recent remix gotcha before. I think I did it a lot. It's the Ay Ayakashi Chemist Shop. It will load. But yeah. There we go. It has the like the twin tail cat. Um, I should probably specify two tail cat. Probably not twin tail. That's a hairstyle. Um, oh man, I. I 50 spins, huh? For 15 glasses. Okay. Wait a second, I wonder. I want to check. Nope, there's no bonus rewards. Okay. What I'm going to be saving my ticket for is the, um, what is it called? Star Palace Gotcha. That'll be coming out soon. That's the one I love. I love stars, if you didn't know. I'm skipping this because seems to be lagging a bit. Forked tails is what they call it. Okay. The second view that's correct. Do, do, do. do I have that background already? I'm trying to think. I know I have several items in here and hopefully this means I get a a lot of his points in the uh, one thing. My bonus points in the uh, snap contest. We'll see. But yeah. Um, I did something stupid with this snap contest. Uh, I was thinking about it and I'm looking like, oh, 2 million points. Okay, I can do that. So I spent the last hour trying to get 2 million points. I did it. And I'm like, wait, I got a premium gacha ticket. Where's the reward? I thought it was supposed to be the frame item, but it wasn't. I think we'll just do 20 spins for this because I already have several items already. And my main focus of this video will be mostly addressing the charm point changes. But if we get anything good, We'll be content. This is getting a lot of uniques. Hmm. Maybe we should do. Sixteen. Usher's sure way you can see like the. Items you got from a remix already. Like, I don't know, maybe add like a like a little dot or something in the top right corner instead of the frame, like the pink frame that shows what you spun and the rec the scotcher like recent uh, incarnation. I don't know what to describe it as, but like yeah, yeah, or it's red, I guess. Yeah, but here the red one. I like a little dot or something to say, oh yeah, you got this previously. It's already in your inventory. Um, hmm, 15, I'll need it for tonight, won't I? No, no, never mind, I won't need it. I'll just use 16 spins, because I want to go for that face. I'm at 1.5 million, I think. Oh, we got two lanterns. Will we be lucky? I think I do have the stage. I got a unique. I'm trying to think because I thought I had like some of these already. I don't have that decor item, but I think I have the stage for some reason. Or the background. One of them. I'm pretty sure I have one of them. Does it still show you which ones you have? Like if you click it? No, it doesn't. Okay. 
Anyway, um, we're gonna do we're, we're just gonna do one spin, but I want to test something real quickly. Okay, so I was going through my map and I found something that I did not realize because I'm like, okay, there's like usually like a few numbers off, and what I didn't realize was that the trend tickets from um, if you use them on your style points, what they do is that they give you 300, but then the one third 133rd multiplier still applies to it so you get one extra point. Wait, where did the 925 9250 come from? What the hell? Oh, from other players. Okay. Okay, um, it's originally, it should be at 8900. Okay, so you have 8900. I had an idea and I'm gonna double check this. So, you have 1500 from that. That means we have, let's see, 1,500, 7,400. 7, I want to check and see how much we have without a bonus yet. So 7,400. Okay, if, if, if I'm thinking of the math correctly, 7,400, a third of that would be 250-ish. Well, this would be, what, 247? 247 and then 15 262 262 282 let's go if it's right nope it's wrong um okay let's get one right let's go I'm really impressing everyone right here. 419. 419. Four nineteen. Okay, wait one second. So what I was originally thinking of was that it is the one thirty third of the seventy four hundred. So, yeah, I'll just type it out. 7400 times 0 0.03 equals 2222. I was not even close. So, 2222 plus, plus 150 equals 372. Plus 20 would be 392. Where is that other one coming from then? Where is that other, where's that other number coming from? Hmm. I don't know where that other number's coming from. Okay. All right. Uh, we'll do comments and then we'll talk about the new trying point update stuff. Um, Avery, I love your show. Awesome. I'm an active player. May I send a friend request? And I said, Thank you very much. And yes, you can send a friend request. I think I accepted it already, but I'll double check after. Um, but thank you, Avery. Uh, Calcifer, thank you for more info on Snap. I hope you don't mind, but I sent a friend request. And I said thank you for your support. And I accepted the friend request. Thank you, Calcifer. Another one, hello, your model is very cool. Thank you very much. Oh, actually, someone did comment about that something. Uh, oh, no. I thought I saw someone. I thought I saw someone comment that they saw my show, and this is from the leader Millie. Uh, talking about the next Star Wars, and I'm thinking I might do it. Still debating a bit, but we we'll just have to wait and see. Okay, so now let's talk about this. Nine minutes, nine twenty. So last night they posted an update or an important notice about. Where is it? Which one is it? Uh, this one? Um, about charm point updates for the future. This is what our main crux is going to be. Wait. About trend point of snap contests. Is there the bug happening on the event? Lily to Paradise, Pure Smile. 
bug above is fixed and we have confirmed their trim to set properly since we'll Trim tickets times five. So I guess the uh, event from the club war didn't go well. More than one theme item in your possession. Only one trend. Ah, okay. Interesting. Um, but yeah, about charm points that we're talking about. Also, uh, apparently the poses, they, they don't move anymore. That's frustrating. But yeah, okay, so charm points. Went off on a tangent, 1050. So they post this, and we'll read it carefully. Notice of change on event charm points. The rule of charm point in events will be changed after the event starting on May 31st, 1500 Japanese Standard Time. The main objective of... This is written terribly, but the main objectives of these changes are to correspond to various new items and sales methods, contents of event rewards, and to create a condition that can be enjoyed by all customers, including those who have been playing Kokopa Play for many years and those who have just started Kokopa Play. Detail of the change. The following two points are major changes. Charm point of gacha items change to three levels depending on gacha. Two, most of the items you can get from events become to have charm points. Part of Snap contest items and Tsugoroku's group ranking rewards are not eligible. So, um, one, the Tsugoroku group ranking rewards, those make sense because um, those are old event rewards. So that makes sense. Um, part of Snap contest items, I don't know why some of them won't be working. I'm going to guess possibly because they actually created like six different sets for the snap contest i have no idea why but anyway we'll check this page thing but um in the paragraph under that one all of the information you provided in your support email regarding the specification change will be shared with the team as valuable feedback for future improvements so if you're discontent with this provide your comments to uh cook the play anyway so they address the changes and they love the little document what could it possibly be so i'll just say this when i first read this not only was it confusing but it was also like i wonder what whales complain about this you'll see why when i say that about charm points. Charm points for events are calculated as total of initial charm point 300 and charm point of items. Note that the number of items to be counted has a certain limit. <sighs> so, we probably saw this with that little bug that we just read in the patch notes. Um, so it seems that if you have multiples of the same item, it will not count. So if you have multiples from the same gacha, those will not count. Or at least have a cap limit. Possibly. And then, there's a total of initial 300 charm points. But these will be changing depending on what they are. So first off, charm points of event items. Now it seems that all event items, or at least most of them, will now have charm points, which can be good. Because if you like think back to the recent Side Wars, the last SSR item was a decor item with no charm points. However, if you look at what it says, SSR, S rare, and rare items have 800, and the tops, Deco 1 and Deco 2, which are the decor items for your show or profile. No, your show, yes, right. Have 300. However, we do not know if they will be added together. So let's say it was just a Deco item that was just like a normal item that would have 300. However, if it was like the one from the club style uh, style wars event that would be an s rare item and it would also be a deco item so does that mean it will be have 300 will it have 800 or will they be added together to have 1100 still not clear about that 
Turn points of ranking rewards will be added to next events, and both points of limited bonus rewards will be added to ongoing events, first or second half in the event. So we have an example, ongoing event, point limited time bonus charm. Um, that would be specific for that event. So how like there's just different halves in like the catch event where like the last reward is like, oh, this one will carry over to the next half. Yeah. Well, now the events from ongoing event A will carry over partially of those items, at least partially of the charm, to the next event entirely. It seems charm points or ranking items will be added to the next event as well. Oh no, those are ranking rewards, never mind. Okay. Um, items of other category in the ranking rewards of snap contest of your ranking rewards has to go to agreement to not have charm points. Okay. Now this is the uh, controversial stuff. Charm point of gotcha item. You can check items that have charm points from charm tab in the events page. Also, each gotcha has a different charm point. The sign is displayed on the gotcha list or image of gotcha detail. You see those three stars with extra charm. Seems what they'll be doing is they're going to be categorizing gotcha based on these stars now. And that will determine how much an item gets charm points. Now. When I first thought of this, I was angry, but as I thought about it more, I'm thinking, I am thinking very hard of what they're doing with this. So, I know a lot of people wanted a trade system, and I think this is what I, because I made a suggestion, and that was to have it where certain items release after a certain point will be able to be traded. And I think this is how they're doing it. Because if you had these high level charm points or items of charm points during an event and you just traded it, people could easily just abuse that system. And I'm thinking what they might do is they're going to be using the star system as markers to say which items can and can't be traded if they do add it. That's the only feasible way because otherwise this seems like total garbage and bullshit. Let's go. So they're going to have extra charm. This is for three stars and people are suspecting it'll just be premium gotcha. That's what it is. So 2000 um, for SSR, SRR and rare items. So uh, all eyes seem, will ha seem to have that now. Tops, Deco 1, Deco 2. Um, it seems to be all tops now instead of just the unique tops. So that's somewhat of an improvement. And then all other items will have 300 which is good. Because they used to give 100, but now they're going to give 300. As if you are a paying customer, at least. And then trade without doubling. 10 plus 2 items. So that's the one in the extras down below. If you see me do the 10 spins, usually you know what I'm referring to. They uh, give a bit more than usual, as per se. So instead of having like 1,700, it'll be 2,500. The trade item ring item will be the same thing almost except for the top and then others will not have any charm points uh two star with charm this seems to be the old one like the one that's currently being used at least and you can see like the 1500 for ssr s rare rare 300 for top deco except that it's decreased because we know 500 unique and then others are 100 but this seems to be the more commonly tuned one and people are suspecting this will be the gotchas that are released that you can use tickets on that are new and then one star of charm greatly reduced half like half by that uh 150 58 50 250 and this is probably going to be old remix gotchas and it's possibly for this one maybe remix gotchas that are premium might be for the two star as well. But one star is probably going to be very much scratches. So. Yeah, that's why I was thinking. When I said if they do add items, they have to remove. If they do add a trade system. The only visible way I could see it. Where people do not abuse it would be to have it where the charm points are not added for the event. Or they're severely reduced. And that seems to be what's going on here. I think that might be a suggestion because I know people have 
constantly told Coco Play, add a trading system, add a trade system. And I think that might be what's going on here, and that's why they updated the charm. Now, the question is, would it be feasible? Now I'm looking at this. Because I know that seemed like the best alternative. But it does seem that it greatly favors... It greatly favors um, pay to win. Whereas um, these ones, because like, even then, if you had this charm from a remix Sacha, they would still carry over as the same value as everything else. So that means, like, what's the point of having those old items then? You just trade them in? Trade them in for premium rare gacha tickets? Will they finally add the VIP gotcha ticket trade in? I don't know, but yeah, I'm 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 just confused. Like I'm upset, but also I'm like trying to look at the brighter side. Like that's the only other way I could think of is like why would they make these such great changes unless they're planning on adding something that people have been asking for? That would be the trading system. Uh, but charm points of other items in addition to the above, you also have a chance to get charm points from limited campaigns, etc. They're probably VIP gotchas. Actually, wait one second. Nope. I was going to say, actually, wait. Now think about it. Maybe that is the VIP gotcha, but I'm like, nope. There's a... Trade in of doubling and ten plus two and trade in and ring. So no, no, it's premium. It's one hundred percent premium. Never mind. Anyway, um, yeah. Anyway, uh, I apologize. I apparently went on for ten minutes and complaining and thinking. So I think, I think, I think it greatly affects is that it's going to deteriorate older Coco Play players because of the remix. Because if, if I'm thinking this is correctly, the one star is going to be remix. That's going to greatly reduce the value of an item. Where only the value it'll have is the appearance value. Which might suggest a trading system is coming into play. That's just a prediction. It's not certain. It's not guaranteed. This is the only way I could think of why would they greatly reduce the charm points. Like I thought what they could have done was just say, Oh, if you trade this item, it doesn't have charm points anymore. Seems like they'll, they'll still have charm points, but greatly reduced. But instead, it affects every single item, even if you don't trade it. <sighs> so I'm just confused and conflicted about this. Anyway, uh, sorry for my long rambling. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you uh, have good luck with your gacha spins and good luck in the events. Um, yeah, I'm going to try to get that uh, wolf face. and uh, Hopefully I can do that. But yeah, thank you all for your continued support. I will see you in the next one. Um, which will probably be Star Palace. But yeah. Anyway, poof poof.